The Steam Next Fest is fast approaching, and that's got a lot of people, me included, very excited. This is the time where a lot of game devs are starting to show off the titles that they've been working so hard on, and start to push out demos for us to play. This list will be some of the games to keep an eye out for, and maybe even give the demo a cheeky try if it's something that you like the look of. Bluefish Yokohama is a relaxing tile-based puzzle game set in most adorable Japanese restaurants. You play a little escapee fish as you need to jump, bump, bounce and splash through 50 different levels. I'm sure the customers will be a little bit worried to eat food after a fish has just been jumping around everywhere, but it's fine as long as the little fella gets to where he's going. Bluefish Yokohama will be releasing on the 17th of February this year, and a demo will be playable very soon. Furtive is a multiplayer open world survival game which you play as an escapee on a military controlled island. You'll need to gather resources, build a shelter and survive the onslaught that is being sent after you. You can play with up to three other friends so get them on a hangout and enjoy the demo together. The game does have a campaign as well which you can work towards escaping and surviving the island. Furtive currently doesn't have a release date but get it wishlisted. Shadow Doubt is an immersive sandbox detective stealth game set in a sci-fi noir city of crime and corruption. The game lets you take on the whole case, from start to finish, be the first to the crime scene, follow around the suspects, and make sure to get them before they kill again. Warning, this game is most likely going to give you a noir detective voice, so be prepared for that. Shadows of Doubt is stated to be released in early 2023, so keep your eyes open for a drop in Detective. Tape to Tape is a roguelike hockey game. Words I thought I'd never say in the same sentence, but man does this look awesome. You need to recruit players, explore synergies, find upgrades, manage your team, and choose your own path to victory. I adore roguelikes and games like this. I can see them skating right to the top of the charts. Tape to Tape currently doesn't have a release date, but get it wishlisted anyway. The Lost Bloodlines is a single player third person adventure game set within the medieval times where you will venture through castles, dungeons and unknown towns where each encounter could be your last. The game is giving me strong Prince of Persia mechanics meets Mountain Blade settings. Very excited to see where this game goes and to try the demo. The Lost Bloodline currently doesn't have a release date, but get it wishlisted. The Magical Mixture Mill is a cosy exploration crafting sim where you play as a former adventurer 
who will learn everything there is to know from a mushroom-loving witch about alchemy. You will need to build up your workshop and ensure you use the right ingredients to keep your customers coming back. If you love yourself some farming management sim games that are adorable, this one is going to be perfect for you. The Magical Mixture Mill will be releasing this year, and guess what? The demo is live right now, so go play it. Thank you everyone who stayed around to the end. Leave me a comment of which one you will be playing, and I will speak to you all soon.